another, another in this circle Keeps getting smaller and smaller Smaller and smaller This circle Keeps getting smaller and smaller Smaller and smaller What's going on everybody? My name is Joey Natto and I am an artist slash music producer and welcome to another episode of Music Producer Reacts. Check it out. I want to shout out the artist Crypt. For the few that don't know who he is, link is in the description below. But thanks to him sharing um, a link of a song he did with the artist Rain, I was able to discover this new artist Rain. Now it's interesting, I feel like whenever somebody got to get on a song with with a uh, crypt because crypt is known for his rapid flow artist has to have some kind of rapid flow himself to keep up a little bit so i mean i'll, I'll get right to the point I, i'm curious to see if this uh this artist can do that now though i will be paying attention to rain and crypt's delivery and lyrics and everything like that i'm gonna be also be paying attention to the music production elements of the song so i'll be able to point out like what kind of sounds are which in case you didn't know or if you didn't hear them at all it'll be like magic if you're on Instagram, make sure to follow me at Lucky Boy Nato. And if you're on Twitter, follow me at Lucky Boy Nato as well. Come on through the DMs. Come on. Just come on down and just say hi. And I'll say hi back because I was raised right by my mother. All right. No more time to waste. So, Rain and Crypt with rap is a sport. Oh, that title. Hmm. Let's get into it. Crooks and castles, okay. Now it's crooks, right? Okay. Okay. What a real one gets shunned and hit with the needless hate. So late, but hey, I'll stay in my lane. It's the right way. I won't fake my way to the high stage. I'm a fucker for a couple younger, never come as a kind of be one to cut it up because I'm a little late. Okay. I think we know where uh, Crip Crip wants all the smoke. Okay, that's what's going on right now. Um. But yo, he, he he just laid that out so perfectly. Yo, his wording was so dope there and it was so simple. You know, the ones with like faking and with clout stuff or doing like grimy stuff to get where they are. And he's like, yo, I'm gonna say I'm gonna still do me. I'm gonna still, you know, be humble and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna screw over other people on the come up, you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna support everybody that works with me type of thing. Like, yo, he's just th th those are some noble bars right there and aggressive at the same time. Perfect blend of both. Let me pay attention to this beat a little bit. Wait till I rise to fame and cry and ignite the flame of the rap game. What's happening? This track is the fast lane of the highway, so get the fuck out of my way. People will talk about me in the road. He's so cold with the stuff he knows. When the word is heard, if it first converses another combo, when who should go? All right, there's a that, that was a cool little drum fill right there, uh, transitioning to the beat. But that's just a uh, that's just a pretty simple synthesizer sound. Just like a bubble synthesizer type noise. I guess I could explain it. That's how I would put it. Some might call it something different. And the beat just it has a good you know it has a good bounce to it. Just kicks, claps, kicks, pretty basic clap, hi hats, uh, just rolling throughout the beat. So it's kind of like you know a trap beat. But I like how on those down beats there's like a eh, eh, eh. It's like a uh, it's like a reverb vocal sound. You can listen if you listen very closely, you can hear it. And then there's just very subby 808s. They're not like grimy. They're not dirty 808s. They're just like they just play their part and provide the foundation of the low end in the beat. So yeah, let's keep going. Generation with loyalty is just another fucking tattoo. Yeah. Love is just another fucking quote. Yeah. Lie is just a fucking new truth. Yeah. A few dudes who will screw okay. you from a couple stacks and fucking new tools. Get the fuck away if you about that life. Cause the ER is the only place that I see you. Life yeah. is two rules. The ER is the only place I see you. Ooh. But quick and remember rule number one. Keep your head high and your middle finger high. Fuck up everyone who wants some. Do some shit that yep. is so different than anybody else under the sun. Yep. Cause when it comes to life and to be the best inside, you have to be odd to be nice. Boom. Uh, hold on. My, my bad. Okay, this is rain right here, so I, I just cut him off. My bad. But, yo, um, great point. I love that. I love that lyric there. He's saying, uh, how he's saying you got to stand out from the crowd in order to be... You got to stand out from the crowd in order to be loud, basically. You got to stand out. You got to be unique. You got to have your own lane. There has to be something different about you. People don't want discounts. Yes, they do. Okay, people don't want discount artists. They want something original. Let's see if Rain brings something original here. Oh, that's cool. Is he outside of, like, a high school or a college? 
I want to do that. That's cool. <laughs> Life to be the best inside. You had to be odd to be number one. We're getting even, but we don't need to pull up on you whenever we got a problem, dog. Tell me to my face, you don't like my song. Okay. Just say you did a couple things wrong. You're in deep. It gets deeper. The Grim Reapers with the Crypt Keeper. I would love to buy you another diva. Ain't nobody really gonna miss you. We don't need you. Always gonna remind that I'm rocking with a machine gun. Four now. Okay, oh, and he just said machine gun, so I figured that's a perfect place, perfect segue right here. Yo, going back to what I said at the top of the video, or the beginning of the video, he's coming with the, the rapid flow. The something that I cannot do. To any artist I can, salute. He has an interesting style here. This is a, this may sound a little strange, but the, I could tell there's a lot of cut-ins in his vocals, meaning like he um, does a lot of punch-ins when he's recording. He like puts his his words in like sections. It's it's kind of cool when artists do that. An artist that definitely does that all the time. Ti, Ti always did that. I don't think that man has ever done a verse all the way through. And his cut-ins and punch-ins are so obvious. But I like his because his kind of stand out, and the way it's engineered, the way the song is engineered is kind of interesting too. Because he's like, I don't know. It sounds like he's closer to the mic sometimes. Like he's like, double double love it, double double, and then he cuts in, and then he's like, parts where he's rapping a little slower, a little more moderate tempo. I guess is a better way of saying it. He sounds like he's farther away from the mic, and it sounds like more reverb is on his voice. It's almost like different points he's making. He wants them to stand out on their own. I think that's pretty cool. All right, all right, look, look, there's an elephant in the room right now, right? There's an elephant in the room. This is a diss against Dax. <laughs> this is, this is I, I don't know how many more lines can make it even any more obvious. I mean, it's in the title. I was trying to avoid saying it, but it's pretty, it's pretty obvious what's going on here. You ain't Marshall unless you're a third string play on the bench with a bum knee. Cause please, Ooh. don't play me. Oh, you a hater, hater. We ain't crazy. You a player, hater, cause you hate the play that got them further than you could have estimated. We saw the way that you escalated. Four horsemen got you frustrated. Never heard of me, but it's a murder scene. You won't be revived, you won't be respirated. I don't get okay. anything. I like that. Anything to do with me unless we're playing sports. No. Since you insisted, I'll lace up my kicks quick and meet you in the middle of the court. I will. I'll be. He just challenged it. He just challenged him to a game when I won in basketball. Now say what you want. I'm not gonna go into all that. Your rappers are coming back for the torch, and I'm knowing that we can pass on the back and forth. Okay. You pass in the short pass. Back and I got forth. it from rappers of sport. Okay. okay. And then they tied in the whole rappers of sport thing there at the end. Yo, his, his flow impressed me. There's crit. Looking over over the riverside like yeah, man should i feed those ducks there's rain there yo rain uh not for nothing but i like your shirt all right so crit did his thing as usual man you know what i like is he's doing these features with other artists um which is dope a lot of you know a lot of big youtubers aren't like humble enough to do that but but Rain was able to keep up with Crypt on this one and he was able to do the rapid flow and everything like that. And he was, uh, you know, showing some courage uh, coming at a big, coming at another big YouTuber or rapper or whatever you want to consider Dax or whatever. I don't like, I don't like talking about all the beef and stuff. It's almost like gossip and I'm not like, that's not my thing. I don't gossip and stuff like that. But as far as like lyrical ability, delivery, cadence on the track, I want to talk about that a little bit. You know, Crypt had, there was the, the one thing that I would have changed about this song if I was in the studio and I was like directing or helping like doctor up the song. If I was like, I think the word I'm looking for is producing. If I was the executive producer for this song, I would have just tried to make sure their energies were a little bit more, um, a little bit more similar to each other. There's a bit too much of a contrast. The song didn't have a hook. So sometimes when a song has a hook, that almost like provides like the bridge or the glue together to um that helps you know that helps two different styles connect a little bit better crypt is crip was rapping pretty aggressive uh kind of like chip on my shoulder type rap and then um i mean rain wanted all the smoke too <laughs> so he but uh he has like a lot more he has like a way more chill flow like all right you know you want to do this and that all right come at me then you know what i mean that's kind of like his that's kind of his delivery and his style it seems like so that's the only thing that i would would have fixed on there but other than that i mean both lyrically every both artists held their own on the song so i mean the beat was pretty simple you know just kind of a looped 
simple beat. Um, but for this type of song, it's kind of okay because it's more about the lyrics and the message and just getting the diss across, basically. Let me know what you guys thought about this song. I'll leave a link for the original video in the description below. And then Crypt and Rain's information will be in the description below as well. Where's my background? There's my background. Toca Shakatato. Again, if you're on Instagram and Twitter, follow me at LuckyBoyNato. Yo, I never, I never even say this, but just if you want, you know, you could subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. I never even say that. I have not said that in a long time. That's crazy. Uh, I don't really got much more to say other than that, and I don't have a cool outro line yet either, so I'll just say I appreciate you guys. Nato! This Now, done doing good like Eddie McDowell. Angry emoji, insert it here, fed up with towel.